here is our two ice cubes, about the same size. I'm gonna go ahead and put them on these. Isaac Newton, you guys might remember the part where they talked about the vegetation of metals, where they put the nickel, I think it was, inside the acid solution, and it grew what looked like little stems. You guys remember seeing that? Guys, that was a really weird phenomenon that for centuries, nobody knew why it worked, until we did a lot of experiments, and now we know exactly why it works. Well, this one right here, here's our phenomenon, and I'll tell you guys, I can't teach you one thing that explains this. And your one question you're going to be asked on your next test, guess what it is? Why, is it Why does this happen? And a very detailed explanation. Okay? And every lab we do over the next week and a half, I think I've got five or six of them, has a little piece of why this happens. And the whole thing over the next few days is going to be able to figure out how the labs that we're doing, what they tell us about this. And it's pretty obvious the difference is one is melting way faster than the other one. As a matter of fact, I can't even see any melting on the one on the right yet. And the one here on the metal is probably over halfway melted right now. Well, you know, the one keeps moving because it's floating. There's a lot of water on there. That, 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 that uh, rubber band there keeps that water kind of held in there. But the rubber band has nothing to do with how this works. What the rubber band is doing is it's making sure that that ice cube doesn't do what? Uh, yeah, the, just float right over the side. It holds it on there. So, the, but the rubber band, I will tell you that much, nothing to do with the phenomenon itself. Okay? Yeah? Um, once the metal cools down, will the ice once the metal cools down, so the metal's heated well, up right now? It's, well, it's going to cool down a little bit more because the ice cube is cold during the room temperature. Mm -hmm.